hurt yet? Oh my god. Alright, now we gotta start all over again. I didn't realize it wasn't recording. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Where am I? Happy St. Patrick's Day. Yay! Got on my green glasses. I forgot my earrings. Oh my god. I got green eyes. I just found another container. So I was doing a an open and I opened this little zipper thing and look what I find inside. Oh my god. This is so so awesome. Never used. They don't look like they've ever been used. Clay tools. And a nice big giant exacto and it might have extra blades inside I don't know let's look well, maybe not inside maybe not that is just so awesome it's just a little loose yeah I am so excited I'm like in tears over that one that's awesome the next thing I pulled out of the container all right, uh, this is border molds. Oops, I see glare. Border molds for clay. Um, like you put in, see here the picture. Ah, there we go. You put it in the thing, mold. Oh my gosh. I can use that for all, <laughs> all kinds of. My brain is going. Uh, then I have these. How many are in here? Two of them. Clay stamps, texture stamps. Uh, this is called the Romance Pack, and it's got, I can't see, it's got the script like we're seeing on the front here, the writing, and then it's got like a lace, a lace kind of, uh, it's called Victorian Lace. One's called Victorian Lace, one's called Love Letter. That is awesome. And then this one is called another texture stamp. This one is called Cultural. Cultural. This is two also. Okay. Um, one is, they're not labeled on the back of this one, but one's got kind of a Moroccan look to it. Kind of that, I don't know, reminds me of the Morocco texture. That is not the same one. Extra deep and finely detailed. Let's pull it out. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh. <gasps> okay, so here's the Victorian lace, it's called. It's written on there Victorian lace, right there. That is awesome. Rubber texture stamps. But this other one, oh my god. It's a whole bunch. What's it called? Ethnic borders. Oh my gosh, look at that. Celtic knots. Ooh oh my goodness, look at that. Those are awesome. Oh, look at that. Ooh. I'm going to be having fun. I'm going to flip that over so you can see the front. Oops, I put it in the wrong thing. <laughs> okay, hold on. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. I am so excited. What's next? I don't know if I can stand it. Oh, a little tri-bead roller. I have one of these. It's one of those, it's a plastic, like you, and it makes beads. It's pretty awesome. Try bead roller. Make spike cones and round and an oval. There's the different shapes it makes. Oval, round, spike cone. All right, awesome. Ooh, I was just looking at these at Amazon yesterday going, God, wish I could buy one of those. And I got one. It's an extruder with a crank on it. I have an extruder that's a push 
oh my gosh, no, I can't even do it. So this is going to be so, oh my gosh, these are awesome to make all kinds of ropes and tubes and shapes and oh my god. Clay classes coming up. Clay tutorials coming up. What's this? Create your own custom transfers for K clay. Oh, it's an inkjet. What's it? Oh, it's inkjet stock. Make your own transfers with an inkjet printer. Transfer your images onto polymer clay, paper, fabric, and more. Oh, awesome. I have no idea how to use that, but that might be pretty cool. Instructions and tips included inside. We'll have to check into that. That's awesome. Oh my goodness. What have we got? Some bottles of... What is that? Oh, sanding swabs. Yay. Can never have too many sanding swabs. Oh, and it has the grits associated with the color. Boy, that's bright light. I said the grits are associated with the color. All right, I can put that right here in my files drawer already. One of my things would be more organized, right? Okay, some other bottles of stuff in the bag. What we got here? Poly binder. That's awesome. Let's see. This box, a um, tube of poly binder. Easy and safe, no waste, waste mess, no waste, brush on applicator, fuses in section, seconds, high tip adhesive for clay. Yay! So it's kind of like the polybond, but this is called polybonder. Very nice. This, <gasps> dimensional gloss for crafts and polymer clay. Yay, dimensional gloss, this is awesome. Awesome. So, still sounds like it's liquidy. I'm so excited. Awesome, awesome. This is terrible. My garage is such a haphazard chaos in there that I keep finding these things. It is cool though that I keep getting Christmas. All right, we got another. What's this? <gasps> Cutters. Yay! Look at all those cool shapes. I don't even know what they are. There's some teardrops and some flowers. I don't know what that is. Some just random, random shape. There's no label with this. Pretty awesome. So cookie cutters. I'll put those over here with my other cookie cutters. Actually, clay cutters. Let's see what else we got here. There's another open box. Exacto blades for the exacto knife. Yay! Yay! That's this one. These look like spacing tools. Yes, they are acrylic slats, six sizes. So when you're rolling by hand, you use these slats. They come in pairs. She said confidently. Um, and so it makes it the same level, so that you, when you're rolling, it's the same width all the way across. That is awesome. And what's this say? Cards. Well, these are color coded as well, and it comes in inches, millimeters, and cards. Cards. So some people use playing cards, and so it tells you how many cards each one of these is equal to. Awesome. A lot of clay tools in this container. In fact, everything's been clay so far, right? 